feel like that, like that whole, like, as a little kid, like, yeah, you would want to hear it, but like here now, did I expect my mom to be single her whole life? Not. Like, I think it was unrealistic and now it doesn't really bother me. I think because they have three other kids, they're married, like, you can't go back in time. And I wouldn't want to go back in time and, like, switch it because then I wouldn't have my brothers. Did you hear what she just said? She doesn't want to... This doesn't really bother me. They have three other kids. That's their family. They have those three kids, and then there's me. And I'm over here, and then he's over there, and then he doesn't believe me, and he's snooping through my stuff. And well, I mean, come on. I mean, just I'd just rather go somewhere else. I don't I belong like here, right? Where we're at. Yeah. I just don't belong. This can't work. He's willing to work on this. She's willing to work on this. The question is, are you? You have to say what you mean, mean what you say, and if you if, if, if you say I'm going to do something or not do something, you have to you have to live up to that. If you say, look, you don't need to snoop through my phone because I'm not going to make plans to run away and then execute those plans. I'm not going to do that. So you don't have to snoop through my phone. You can give me privacy. You have to be trustworthy. You've got to say, if we say, right, we're going to work on this for 90 days. And, and I'll get you some professional help with this. You say you can't get therapist, you can't get this, you can't get that. I'll fix that. I'll fix that. I'll, I'll get you family therapy on a regular basis. I'll, I'll give you, I'll, I'll, I'll give you weekly sessions a, as a family and her individually if necessary. Uh, we're starting with just ten, through the end of the year, ten weeks in a row. What do we have to do? But I need you to agree. That for that period of time, you'll agree to work the problem instead of run from the problem. And at the end of that time, you can reassess. But you've got to have the emotional integrity to commit to that for that period of time. Can you do that? I think, yeah, I can. Well, you either it's, can or you can't. I mean, don't tell me you can if you can't. I mean, no, I can't. For me, it's really easy to be completely honest and open with my mom. But with my dad, I just it's hard because I don't care. Yeah. What I'm asking you to do is commit to working on the problem with professionals that I bring to the table, and I'm appealing to your greed to get you what you want without having to run away. Will you make that commitment to me? Yeah. Okay. And you'll make that commitment. Yes, of course. And, and you'll make that commitment. And, and you know, we're in a pandemic right now. I, I will set it up through teletherapy and, and telemedicine with Doctor On Demand, which is a, a company that we actually own. My, my son founded it. I'll jumpstart you with like 10 sessions with a really good doctoral level therapist. That's where to start. Okay. That makes sense. I was focusing on the trauma and feeling like that's what needed to be fixed. Cause... I'm not saying it doesn't. I'm saying I want to start with this okay. and then deal with it all let the professionals decide the order but start with this okay. does that make sense mm -hmm. okay all right i want to thank my guests today and if you would like more information about today's episode then log on to drphil.com you can also find me on facebook twitter instagram tiktok wherever if you at home want to have your own doctor on demand go to google play store or the apple app store and download the Doctor On Demand app. Don't forget to subscribe to Robin's podcast, I've Got a Secret. She talks to all kinds of people about all...